Hey, Tom Beal here with a Make Today Great Moment. You have to start where you are. Let me explain this. On my flight back from San Diego yesterday, I had the awesome pleasure of having a layover in Denver. And while I was waiting to board the plane, uh, this, this young man who's uh, 27, as I come to find out, in a wheelchair, wheeled himself up near me when I happened to be on the phone with somebody explaining uh, what had happened and transpired in San Diego, obviously the Mankini on stage story. So he started chuckling and I noticed it as I'm describing the story. So as soon as I hung up the phone, hey man, what's your name? How's it going? So we started communicating and come to find out he was flying to Fort Lauderdale, same as I was. And after further inquiries, he said he was flying there to compete in the Paralympics. Um, so here he is, 27 year old, tell, telling me that he had taken a seven-year hiatus. This, he's, he's back uh, to show these youngins how to do it, per se. And uh, so he's coming back out of AKA retirement to uh, uh, see if he still has the stuff. And apparently he does, because after further conversations with him, he's ranked number one and most likely will go to uh, the Paralympics if he uh, does well at this qualifier and, and, and some other things like that. So um, you have to start where you are. And this goes no matter who you are and where you are, listening to this and watching this right now, we all have started where we are. You know, so I'm sure, his name's John, John Roberts. I'm sure John, at one point, uh, realized that, that, hey, we're all dealt the cards that we have, good, bad, or indifferent. We are what we are, and that's all we know. So we don't know any differently. So I'm not saying some people have it uh, better or worse than others. I'm saying we all have to start where we are. Some of us have different strengths, weaknesses, uh, passions and and uh, positive and negative attributes we're all dealt cards some are good some are bad some are different but it all is awesome you know and it's all up to you as to what you want to do with the cards that you have a lot of people have won huge poker games with crappy cards and uh, they walk away with the prize because they they know how to work those cards and a lot of people who have what some may label as uh, adversities or challenges that live the most fulfilling lives uh, that, that, that would put our lives to shame. So here was, for instance, John, I'm just, I, I'm just saying, uh, ret retrospectively looking at my life and possibly comparing it to his, there probably was a point when he didn't race wheelchairs, right? So it was probably a point where he had the idea, the vision, I want to race wheelchairs. And then he probably said, hmm, I wonder how I go about doing that. He probably did some research. Who knows if, if it was online? Who knows if it was asking around? Uh, so he, he probably uh, did that. And then he probably believed that, you know what, I think I can do this. And then he probably jumped over to practicing. All right, well, I guess if I'm going to do it, I'm going to either go find a coach who can help me do this or I'm going to learn as much as I can and try to do it myself and possibly find a coach along the way. And I'm guessing he probably enjoyed it. If he's competitive and at the level that he is now, chances are good after practicing and after uh, doing it, it gave him some passion. It inspired him and ignited him to want to do better and want to better his personal best. And I'm saying this after coming out of yoga upstairs here. And as you can see, sweaty, just hot. And here I was struggling to breathe in this class. Um, and it, it made me think of a lot of things. Number one, focus on breathing. Breathing in. Breathing out, one of the main ingredients to life that we take for granted so many times. And after class uh, and some deep conversations, I've been fortunate to be uh, by both of my parents' last breath. And I've talked many times in these Make Today Great videos that we all have that last day. We don't know when that is, so live life to the fullest. But there will be that time when we have that last breath, and we don't know when that's going to be but just enjoy the finer things and be grateful for the finer things because when it's all said and done, as I mentioned, we all have to start where we are. We all were dealt the cards we were dealt. We all have to create that vision of what it is we want. And, and for instance, up in, in uh, this, this Bikram Yoga, I'm competitive. So I'm gonna try to push myself a little bit further maybe than I even should because it's putting me outside the breathing. And that's where I start to get that blackout, go to black type of feeling. So. Uh, you don't have to go for broke, you know, in this internet marketing world. You don't throw every last cent you have if you're brand new to, to advertising and, and throw it at one ad. It's either rolling the, rolling the dice, you know, you, you start small, you figure it out, and you fine tune from there. So you have that vision, you believe in yourself, you identify people who are do, doing what you want to do, you align yourself with them, you take consistent and persistent actions that are proper to get you from where you are to where you want to be, and you enjoy it. You have fun. Make the most of your life. 
and I'm, I'm fortunate. I feel truly blessed that you're watching this, and I want to hear from you. Share your feedback. Share your comments below, and I'm going to post the video for John. Uh, please. Uh, he doesn't have Facebook yet, but uh, I told him I'm going to help him set up his um, Facebook profile. And please share the love. Show, show some support for him on his journey to the Paralympics to show those youngins who are about 20 years old, he's 27, how it's done. So uh, pass that along, and by the time he comes on Facebook, he'll have some, uh, some love and support uh, from, from his Facebook friends he didn't even know he had, uh, rooting him on, and, uh, and, and or YouTube. I'll post it on YouTube as well. So leave your comments below if these messages are impacting you. I want to hear from you. All right, until tomorrow, make today great.